NATO will increase its peacekeeping force in Kosovo if there is an escalation of tensions with neighboring Serbia, the alliance's chief said on Wednesday on the eve of EU-facilitated talks between the estranged Western Balkan neighbors. We have now a significant mission, a military presence in Kosovo close to 4,000 troops. Jan Stoltenberg told a news conference after talks with Serbian President Aleksandar Vucic in Brussels, who stood alongside him. The threats, risks and challenges that NATO faces in the current security environment are felt by our country as well. Kosovo's institutions and citizens in the current situation have reason to be vigilant about destructive approach of our northern neighbor towards Kosovo and the region in general under Russia's detrimental agenda for Europe and the Balkans. But the only way uh, towards sustainable peace is for Belgrade and Pristina to resolve their issues through the EU-facilitated dialogue. I urge uh, all parties to engage positively and constructively in the latest round of the EU talks tomorrow. It is an opportunity for Kosovo to demonstrate that it is a responsible actor within the Euro-Atlantic community. NATO is in Kosovo with close to 4,000 troops, and that is uh, currently our biggest military presence outside NATO territory. And that demonstrates a very strong commitment to peace, to stability, uh, to, uh, uh, to the Western Balkans, to Kosovo. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.